Greetings from Lakeland College. We hope this video helps you both understand the actual process of completing your financial aid here, as well as how Lakeland goes about awarding it. For 150 years, Lakeland has been dedicated to making a high quality college education and experience as affordable as possible. We do that by putting the best possible financial aid award forward, with the hope that it will bring the cost of attendance down to a level that will work for you and your family. Let's start with the process of applying for aid here at Lakeland. Lakeland requires two forms, the Lakeland College Financial Aid Application and the Free Application for Federal Student Aid, or FAFSA. Every student who has applied for admission to the college will have received an ID number and password. You will need this to log into your account at my.lakeland.edu. There, click on the Financial Aid Student Access Net Partner link, found in the Quick Links box on the left side of the webpage. In the window that this brings up, click on the Apply Online tab. This is where you complete the application, addressing just a few simple questions specific to Lakeland. Completing the FAFSA is the next step in applying for financial aid. This can be done at fafsa.gov and is accessible after the first of the year. The FAFSA will allow you to send your results to 10 different schools. You do this by entering the school code and Lakeland's is 003854. Lakeland's priority date to have the FAFSA completed is March 15th. The FAFSA will generate what's called your Estimated Family Contribution, or EFC. The EFC is the number that financial aid offices need in order to determine eligibility for federal, state, and Lakeland College grant, loan, and work programs. Once both the Lakeland Financial Aid application and the FAFSA are completed in their entirety, Lakeland will then have the necessary information to put together your financial aid award. So how does Lakeland award financial aid? We need to start by determining the cost of attendance, which consists of billable costs, like tuition, housing, and meal plans, and non-billable costs, like books, transportation, etc. Then your EFC is subtracted from the cost of attendance in order to determine your financial need. This information is used by Lakeland's Financial Aid Office to put together the best possible financial aid award for you. For many families, the real number that is of concern to them is the out-of-pocket cost. In other words, what will be owed by the start of classes after financial aid is applied. With this information, there is an important distinction to be made between billable and non-billable costs. Billable costs are the only direct costs that you will need to satisfy by the start of classes. You will not be charged upfront for non-billable costs. These are unique to each student and will not be part of the bill from the college. In other words, subtract the scholarships, grants, and loans in your financial aid award from the billable costs to determine your out-of-pocket cost. We hope this short video has been helpful in clarifying your financial aid world here at Lakeland College. As always, we encourage you to contact the admissions or financial aid offices should you have questions. Financial aid is an entirely individual process. No two families have the exact same set of circumstances. Because of that, know that we're here to help you wade through this important part of your college search process. We look forward to helping you learn more about what it means to be a Lakeland College Muskie.